The next thing which comes up over here is a grouping. So let us see what is grouping over here. So let me create a visual. I would like to display the sales on the basis of the region. Let me make it as a horizontal bar chart. Uh, I will give slightly more space to it. All right, and let me display the label. Now, assuming I want to display the combined sales of the central and the south. So using the control click, I selected the two. I got a pop-up menu in which you are getting an option called group. Just click on this group. Here it goes. So now we are getting the combined sales of central and south. And if you will notice, you are getting a new field over here with the name region group. And this is the icon for the group. Let me remove this. Right click over here. I will say delete. Once again, I can take the sub, not the subcategory. I will take the same example, the region over here. I will like to take the central and the south. As I told you, there are multiple ways to do the same task in Tableau. You can go to the tool bar, uh, toolbar and you will see there's an option called group members, group on the basis of the region. The same output is here also. Okay. Once again, I will remove the group from here. I will delete this group. This time, I will like to take the subcategory. Let's make it as an entire view. And I wanted to create a group. So this is known as grouping using the data pane. So I can go to the subcategory, click on this drop down. I will say create group. And I want to create a group of the stationary related products like paper, label, envelopes. Let's take something else for an example, art say group if you want you can give it some name stationary enter apply okay here is the stationary group you can take it over here remove it from here and here it goes so now you will not be getting paper label envelope separately but it is appearing as a group over here it is appearing in a stationary group is that clear? So that is known as grouping and grouping using the data pane.